to make some money in Grand Theft Auto Online? Then I've got you covered because in today's video I'll be showing you a solo money glitch. Absolutely solo with custom plates. Obviously you need custom plates for this glitch. And I'll be also showing you a god mode as well. Adding on to this solo money glitch in today's video as well. So check that out right at the end of today's video. But without further ado, let's just kick off in today's video. So let's get the ins and outs out of the way first. So we need a LG RHA in one garage, and possibly a CO garage. We also need another garage, obviously, with an LG Retro Custom with custom plates. We also need a special vehicle that can access the LSCs, like the Ruiner 2000, the Blazer Aqua. And we also need a custom mod shop inside of your office as well. So once we've got all that all the way, let's get on with it. So as you can see, I'm doing this on PC, but you can do this on any console and device that you have to be able to do this glitch. So once you've got all that away, so what you want to do is open the interaction menu up. You want to go to down to hide options. You want to go to other and you want to show special vehicle races. And as you can see the special races series, you want that green marker on the map to show up. Once you've done now, you want to do is pull up your phone. You want to go to Quit Job and Doomsday Heist. Now you want to wait here until it says Populating Lobby. Once it says Populating Lobby, get inside to that green marker right there. Once you've done that, there we go. The you will now have the grade out option in the interaction menu for the style. So all you want to do is open the interaction menu and request a Runa 2000 or a Blazer Aqua, just anything that can access the LSC. That's more important, that depending how or what you choose or where your office is, you might be able to do this quick as possible. Now once you've got the grab the vehicle, all you want to do is head to one of the Los Santos customs around the map. So once you're there, I'll take you further. So once you are at LSC, around one of the round the map, all you simply want to do is change something on the vehicle. Now, it doesn't matter what you decide to change. You can change the plates, you can change the lights on the vehicle, you can change the colour of the vehicle. It doesn't really matter. Just change something on the vehicle. Once you've changed something on the vehicle, access the, uh, exit the LSC and head back to your office. Now, once you are at the office, all you want to do is go into one of the garages that has your LG Retro Custom inside. So, I've got a custom inside Office Garage 2. So, once you've done that, we're good to go. So, get inside your LG Retro Custom. And you want to spam right on the D-pad to access the customs inside your office. So, spam right on the D-pad right there. All you need to do, once you are in this menu, all you need to do is simply change the personal vehicle license plate on the vehicle. And once you've done that, we're good. So once you've done that, all you want to do is exit the vehicle. And once you've exited the vehicle, wait until you see the orange loading symbol, of course. And you should see that right there. And then go back inside the vehicle by spamming right on the D-pad until it glitches out just like that and puts you back inside of your garage and what should happen you should have a duplicate right there so exit the vehicle go to the elevator or the lift and then you want to change to a different garage so i'm in the office garage two of course so i'm going to go to office garage another office garage once you've changed of course the the floor all you want to do is go back into the elevator or the lift and then exit to ground now, once you've done that, we're simply good to go. Once you're outside, your personal vehicle or your duplicate will be there on the map. So all you need to do is get inside of this duplicate vehicle and then you want to bring it inside to another garage, of course. Uh, just don't blame, just don't mind me with this blaming NPCs getting in the way. But all you want, simply want to do, of course, is bring this to another garage that is full of LG RH8. It needs to be full, otherwise you'll get stuck. Now replace over an LG RH8, and there we go. To continue on, all you want to do is exit your office, 
to, to your ground. Then all you want to do is request another Rare in the 2000, Blazer Aqua. It doesn't really matter, just anything that can actually access the LSC. Now, of course, once it does spawn in, because you won't see it on the map, of course, you need to look around around the map, depending where it will be, because it will spawn in somewhere. You just won't be able to see it. But once you've gone in the vehicle, all you want to do is access another Los Santos Customs around the map. Now, of course, once you are at LS Customs, one of the around the map, all you want to do is simply change the license plate or change the colour of the vehicle or just change anything that you want on the vehicle. Once you change something, exit the customs and then go back to your office garage, of course. So head over to one of your offices, of course. Once you are at your office, all you want to do is go back inside where your Elegit Retro Custom is stored. So mine is stored in Office Garage 2, of course. So I'm going to go in Office Garage 2. Now, once you are in Office Garage and get inside of your LG Retro Custom and spam right on the D-pad to access the customs inside your office. Now, once you are going inside, all you want to do is simply change the license plate on this vehicle. Now, once you change the license plate on this vehicle, then we're able to go to, go to continue on. Once you've done that, you want to exit the vehicle. That's more important. Just go exit the vehicle. Now, once you've exited the vehicle, just wait until the orange loading symbol right at the bottom of the screen pops up. And then all you want to do is go back inside the vehicle and spam right on the D-pad. And what this should do is glitch you out and then just, you know, put you inside of your office garage, of course. And then you'll have a Jupiter duplicate right there. So all you want to do is go back to the elevator or the lift, of course, and then change to another floor. So like Office Garage 1 to Office Garage 2 or Office Garage 2 to Office Garage 3. It doesn't really matter. Just change the lift, uh, change the floor. And then once you've done that, all you want to do is go back to the lift again and then just simply change exit to ground. Now, of course, once you've exited to ground, your vehicle will be there waiting for you. Now, of course, I'll be showing you the God Mode to this side of the glitch now. Now, of course, as you probably don't know, this vehicle is God Mode at this point. As you can see, I'm trying to put some sticky bombs on the ground. And as you can see, there is no way to blow up this vehicle. This vehicle is God Mode at this point. So if you wish to go around the map, just causing nuisance, of course, you know, trying to, you know... I don't know what you guys do on a daily basis in Grand Theft Auto Online. You surely can do, and your vehicle, of course, will be God Mode. Now, of course, once you've finished with all the God Modes, and you wish to bring it back, I'm just going to call uh, the cops off me right now. All you simply want to do is go back into another garage to where your LG RH8s are. Now, of course, just, just yeah, just... Yeah, get rid of the coppers and then go back inside the office garage where your LG RH are. Now, once you've done that, all you simply want to do is replace over it. And then there we go. That's how to finish today's glitch. And that is a solo money glitch with custom plates. And also as well, how to do the, the God mode, which is just a, an add-on to this glitch. I hope you do go on to like this video. But thank you very much, guys, for watching this video. I'd like to thank everyone for subscribing, and I really will catch you in the next video here on my channel. Have a good day, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.